second video for this weekend uh, this video I want to talk a little bit about um, the right hand technique especially when playing like a slow blue style like a, you know a Stevie Ray a dirty pool or a, Philip Sace has a great cover of as the years go passing by that he kind of turned into a you know a slow minor blues and there are many f tricks in there you can get you know, a certain um, a certain type of tone and a certain amount of snap with the right hand and I don't, I don't know that uh, it took me a little bit to get it uh get used to it and i figured i could talk about it here you know You're hearing that big percussive sound from stevie you know what i mean and uh it's it's like the up rakes but you know on the way up he, what he's doing there is he's killing all of the strings but you're getting you know so you're, you're actually deadening the strings except only Letting the one you want to hear ring out, you know, but you get this big sound instead. Of, it's it sounds to me a lot bigger and a lot fatter instead of just going. This to me it just sounds different, you know. And you know, also letting the string bounce off the fatter side of the pick and the skin on your actual fingers can create a really cool kind of. So it creates this really big, fat, thick dynamic that, you know, when you're playing a, a song that's a little, a little mellower and a little down tempo, you kind of want to add as many uh, variables as you can to kind of get, you know, creative and get the most out of the sound. There's a, a method of hybrid picking that goes on a little bit there. Stevie did it a lot, you know, especially when he would be into like the, you know, uh... So he's, you're letting, you know, some fingers rest under those, under these strings here. But that's a lot of that, that certain poppy, like the... It's a lot of that little poppy percussive aggressive sound, those little See, so you got those two that I've just talked about right there, you have that finger picking and then you have the rake more finger picking there 
Because it sounds a lot different then. Sometimes that that picked note with the with the guitar pick itself can sound a little aggressive for what you're going for. I mean, you just you know the. So just a couple of little things, you know, and um, really controlling the dynamics with your right hand. And, you know, you can keep the guitar at one volume. Like I can turn the guitar all the way up, right? And I can play lightly with this hand and use this hand light. dynamic and you're creating a different loud soft loud soft and you're, you're creating this kind of almost emotional roller coaster in a way you know where vocally you're speaking to the note and the note you're coming out aggressive with the note and then you're, you're bringing it back and you're reining it in and then the whole time you have everything you need there because your guitar's volume is full up you're just you're just working on your right hand and, and you know. Sometimes getting control of the right hand is just as important as, you know, you can have your, as long as you're in time, in tune, it doesn't necessarily always meet, matter if you can fire out a million notes with your left hand because your dynamics you can create with your right hand can make that single note sound amazing, you know? So I try to work on that all the time with the right hand technique and just getting the most I can out of picking a string or picking a phrase and then trying to play it with the fingers and see which one sounds a little more dynamic. You know, and I also, like I said, I do play with my I hybrid pick and I play with these two fingers a lot while picking, you know, so, and that's a lot of that. You know, it's a lot of that stuff that I try to work on. So there's just something to apply maybe to your slow blues playing if you're a big SRV fan and Philip Sace fan, and you, you want to play those kind of slow, dirty pool, Tim Pan Alley type blues. Um, it's a great technique, and it's really it's really indicative of the SRV sound. Um, there's a lot of, you know, even like with the Lenny playing. Uh, something to work on something to chip away at. i'm always trying i'm always working on it i figured i'd share it here um second video of the weekend i'll see you guys soon with another one peace <laughs>